in a match that really matters to you, you might feel like, I hate myself. I want to <laughs> die. That's pretty. That's pretty heavy. Oh, sorry. That's just me. Maybe you guys have never lost anything important. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. But I'll tell you what. The productive thing, the productive way to handle it is to calm yourself and ask the other guy, hey, what do I do about that? Or right? what should I have been doing in that situation? And that's what we saw there. And that takes, that's a different type of mentality. And that's what it's all about. It's about the, your mindset and your willingness to accept that you're not the best and that you still have something to learn. And that the other person right? actually did you a favor by showing you something in your game that you didn't know or that needs to be improved. It's, it's that EPO mentality, that like forever the underdog, forever the student, right? Yes, I'm exactly. I was talking to somebody in our scene yes. about like, you know, they're like, I'm trying to master this game. And I'm like, but like, who's the master anyways? He's just like the best student. Every master is just the best student. That's all they ever are. So that's all you should ever strive to be. So, you know, that, always ask questions. That is deep. That is deep. I was right there. The master is the best student. I'm going to remember that one. I've learned a few things. I'm glad I came to PAX West. Thank you so much to Guy. Yeah, I know. We're going to make a shirt out of that, right? Yo. Uh, thanks so much to uh, Geico Gaming for putting on uh, Geico Gaming and E-League for putting on this amateur tournament series. We got uh, we got we got money. We got muscles in the house. <laughs> What's good? What's good? All kinds of gains. All kinds. What do you think about that? The uh, the master is the best student. Um. I think it is definitely the best mentality to have, and I think, you know, anyone who can accept the fact that there's always something to learn will get better every day. Was that your approach to uh, lifting and bodybuilding? Yeah, it's my approach to everything. Smart man. Smart man. This guy right here, here. Flex, flex for him again. Oh, it's our boy. Yeah. It's our yeah, boy. Yeah. Grown oh, boy. Yeah. Looking like Street Fighter V characters back there. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> That's okay. This guy's all natural. Yeah, looking like the all Gundams, not the pilots, you know? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's funny. So we got what looks to be a couple familiar faces. Familiar faces. Trying to march their way through the loser's bracket. Because you can get two chances in these brackets. So you got to right. march your way back to the finals. That's right. For those uh, not familiar with the double elimination format, you have to lose two matches in order to get eliminated, which means... Hey, you got a new lease on life in the loser's bracket, but you got a tough road ahead. You have to all play right. almost double the amount of matches to make it all the way to the end. Ryu on screen versus Colleen. We haven't seen a Ryu win a set never at say PAX never. West. Is this the one? It could be. It could be. I don't is know. Is this the path one? Of my destiny. This is the path of his destiny. His destiny is not <laughs> looks good. Nice not the destiny of choice. Ryu is a world warrior. Yeah. But we he's will see. It, he's in it for the fight. He's got the name for it. This is Grunge. Grunge Ryu. Grunge Ryu. <laughs> I mean, Ryu's been wandering for quite some time. Ryu's literally, literally been wandering since before, since when Kirk Cobain was playing. <laughs> I've never gone that long without shoes. This man has been walking. That's the thing. We, we humans didn't always have shoes. We used to run double marathons in our bare feet. And he, then is, he is the most fundamental. And then, some, yeah, and then something happened that made made humans soft. So Ryu's trying to bring back, you know, that that mentality. The Wanderer. I walk, I travel the earth yeah, looking right for now, the next opponent. Colleen. Getting the offense going in the corner. Sin with V-Trigger still ready to go? Oh. Oh, what did we learn? Maybe we didn't learn a thing. We didn't learn anything from the last time this happened. Nobody heeded Doug's advice except for Nick. Nobody checked to see this. All right, delay, slight delay of game, folks. You know, it's kind of worth it, it, though. I like watching Kenny work. I know. It's you actually. Know, he isn't doing anything. Yeah. He's just hanging out. Is this, uh, is this you guys' is first time watching Street Fighter? Um, yeah, I think so. Um, that happens a lot then? No. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> right. Um, no, this, this is, okay, just for people who didn't see it last time, what happens is that if you have a PS4 controller synced and then that controller walks away without be, without disconnecting, it freezes the game. Oh, that's tragic. Yeah. So that looks all silly, scratch? but you got to take the round they so just finish it, them right? off. Round two. So that's a freebie so. round for Ryu. Well, that's how Ryu's going to get his win. Yeah. That's how Ryu's gonna do it! This was the path of his destiny. 
You don't have to be high tier if they if they DQ themselves. Ruined by the PlayStation UI. Oh my god. Well, there's plenty of seats right there. There's yeah, we got bust out shore use. Okay. Colleen gonna bring back the other way. Seen a lot more structure at the Colleen place so far. Oh no, big opportunity missed, but eh, doesn't matter. Ooh. I think Grunge was already on tilt, mentally defeated. Surprisingly squirrely for a match that felt so dominant for Final Colleen. Round. You know, it was kind of all over the place, but maybe crazy kind of players? a better character to scramble. Dude, crazy players can be difficult to, to you need a you need a strong containment strategy for a crazy player that doesn't care. That's why my strategy is to back away right. <laughs> and stay at a safe distance because I'm not trying to accidentally step on a landmine. I'm trying to just let the grenade go off in the distance and take cover. And maybe in other games is all right, but in five, step on one, you might you might just lose the whole thing. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Oh, see, oh that's what God. I'm talking about. Don't stand there. Are you gonna get a game win? Oh, the short use off point. Only gonna try to bring it back. Has full meter. Be triggered to work Re with. Ryu only needs one hit. Uh -oh. And there it is, going for the meaty. Ryu uh, has to stay cool. Uh, or maybe too cool, I don't I know. I see what you did there. Whoa! That's our boy! One! That's our boy! Ryu's on the board. I, I can't believe it. When was the last time you saw Ryu win a game? Uh, Literally years. not all weekend. He he said it's been years. Street Fighter it's been 4. years? Street Fighter 4. He hasn't seen Ryu win a game since Street Fighter 4. Yo, that, that cosplay is sick, though. Thank you. Yeah. Round one. I think Ryan missed are you, it. Are you, are you uh, all three ball rock? Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> you couldn't see the like forest from the trees. Oh, I, it looks like color six. Nicely done. Here, hold on. We're going to, we, here, come on. No, that, was see, that was proper. We're gonna, we, have, we have seats for you in the front. The stream, the stream would like to see. Oh. You know. Here, come on, here, let's kill some time. There's a camera over here. You got, dude, you guys look great. Here, come on. I'm pretty sure this camera Bring over out, here Kenny. is still active. No, no, switch to the other one. The other one, yeah, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Look at this man, look at this man. Hey. Balrog, Street Fighter 4, Alternate 3. That's pretty look, sick. Man, you look awesome too. Tell, what, uh, I, I live in a cave, uh, I live in a cave and I'm super, Diablo 3, cool Seder. Diablo 3, here. Oh, hold on, hold on. There we go. Nicely done. I don't, I don't about, know which uh, Street Fighter character that what is. What about you? You guys look like you came together. I'm not, I, uh, I live in a cave. I've never, I've never played a video game before, or I don't even, what, what character? <laughs> I'm Vaughn from Final I, 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 I'm Vaughn from Final Fantasy XII. Vaughn from Fantasy Final Fantasy XII. I don't. To be honest with you, I don't know why I'm here. That's a great question. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll tell you why I'm here. Because actually, maybe you guys didn't know. Actually, you know what? The reason why I'm here is because of uh, all this stuff that's going on. Geico and E League have teamed up to do a Street Fighter V amateur tournament series, and there is twenty thousand dollars on the line. That, that's why I'm here. When is it? Yeah, it's right now. It's right now. But the finals are tomorrow. So come back tomorrow, 12 o'clock, and these guys are going to play for $20,000. It's, uh, it's going to be great. Thanks, guys. They were... They were uh, it, yeah, I, I wish you guys would have heard what she, what she said to me, but I'm not trying to get fired, so I won't repeat it. She said, uh, "Decidia is a fighting game." We got that going for us. She said, "She said, why the heck are you here?" Savage. I mean, or maybe I don't know. She knows you're not from this time. Maybe, maybe. Probably. So she didn't. She didn't say heck. I guess we we got it all sorted out. Is it gonna be one one zero one? We'll find out the result of tournament director Kenny Lamb and his decision. I don't know either, man. It's, it's not your fault. Thank you, thank you. I'm, I, you know, I'm like, I'm just a gaming poser, dude. 
I'm just here. I'm just here because I heard esports was blowing up, dude. I was trying to cash in. I don't know anything about games. Yeah, we just got our boards out. So let's see the result of that. Round one. Fight. Just gonna run it back. So Ryu still has the advantage. 1-0 up in the set. Two rounds away. From glorious victory. Alright, well look, from here on out, Doug. You and I are going to, before the players start, we are going to implement your method of checking and make sure that no L control Listen, is Listen, I didn't mean to suggest more work for myself. I'll do it, I'll do it, I'll do it. Don't worry about it. I, I, don't you hate that? Don't you hate when you make a great suggestion and then it turns into them being like, all right, cool, do it. Yeah, by all happens means, to me all the away, time. sir. Happens to me all the time, but don't worry, I'll do it, I'll do it, don't worry. No, we got it. Anyway. We'll see if Grunge can make this happen, though. Able to get that 1-0 that lead just two rounds away, but Colleen has pretty consistently been showing uh, much more structure in this match. Oh my gosh, there are there is hail falling from the sky. One hit from stun. In Thailand, this is crazy. It, it's hot as hell Oh my god, the there. defense. <laughs> but the stun went down, he's not gonna get stunned. Random Shoryu. Lots of resources oh to, to work with. Super Yo. V trigger. The most innovative block strings. Into secret that, buttons. That, that's a sick block string. I mean, that's a, it's actually that's the craziest block string. Yeah. Uh, oh, that was from that was from Colleen's side. What? That's two rounds for Ryu from DQ. You don't have to be Round top tier. Two. You really don't. You can just let them DQ out. One round away. Our boy. What? He's only got like half a half a health bar to work with. We've seen Ryu probably ten times throughout the weekend, and he hasn't been able to hold down one set. Not even in the hands of XSK Samurai was he able to win. It was the first of ten, but he wasn't able to win. Are you taking notes, Mikey? You seen this? Oh wait, hold up, hold the phone. Colleen with the arm breaker. This is this is crazy. <laughs> What a match we oh, have. And it's, and it's slowed down. Back to throwing fireballs. Colleen How? blocking. What, what is the plan here? Just take chips? Oh, big big heel drop. Big combo. If he finishes it, we're going to a third round here. Oh, my gosh. Everybody. Colleen staying alive. Just barely. This is crazy. This is crazy. Let's go. I mean, it, it was complete chaos, and then it was just a standoff. Right? Complete chaos, and then structure. It's, it's, it's the flip of the usual tournament match. match. Right, yeah. Oh, oh, hey, whatever. Only at the Geico E-League Amateur Street Fighter Five Series. Yeah, it's 10 o'clock at the hotel. It's all breakfast for the entire time. It's all scrambles. And then there's all a little scrambles. bit of structure. <laughs> all scrambles all the time. We serve breakfast 24-7. This is what's crazy, though. We can see so much more structure from the Colleen's play. But this is what that random can do to you. This is yes. what that churn can do. It can put so much doubt in your game plan. Oh, yeah, for sure. You got to hold it together mentally. Oh, my gosh. Oh, she's holding okay. it down right now. This trying to get that 1-1. One, one. Look at, oh, my gosh. I like, look at, she just points at him. She just moonwalks back and points at him. Come at me, bro. I got I to gotta say, they really leveled up the back walk animations. Minats is super good, too. I saw that jump back strong, Ryu. Try, try to oh, my gosh. Oh! One hit, anybody can take this. Colleen tries to stay alive for you. Make some noise. Oh my god, fireball, oh fireball. It could go either way. Ah! Oh my gosh. Wow. Everybody give it up. That was definitely no, give it up. That was, He's that was a done nail it. biter. Holy smokes. The, the world that warrior. Was, there was, I mean, that was a legit story arc. I mean, act one, that act two. There were twisted turns. What an, what an exciting conclusion. It could have gone either way. Wow. What? That, you, that was that was crazy. As channeled through. Have you, have you ever seen a match like that? Never. No, that was ridiculous. Not, not with three I don't even know. Well, that, was, that was loser's side of the bracket, trying to work towards that loser's qualifier. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Come over here. Come over here. Come over here. Why, first off, number one, first off, why are you playing Ryu? I'm not playing Ryu, that's him. Oh, man, oh. you got it all backwards. Oh, oh, I got it all no. backwards. Oh, all no, right. gooey. No, dude, like, all right, all right, never mind. All right. Really? Well, that's it? There's nothing? <laughs> well, no, I mean, because now we descend into, like, 
How did you let that happen? <laughs> okay, so look here. I don't play Street Okay, look here. I don't play Street Fighter like that. I'm more of a Guilty Gear person. Oh. Um, anime. I played Street Fighter V since release, and yes, only, yes. the only character <laughs> I kind of like. I didn't really play it that much before Colin came out, so... Okay. Well, it's a tough break, man. But yes, it was a great... <laughs> Everything that happened was everything that happened was unfortunate. Okay. Everything that happened was unfortunate. End it, quote. It sure was. It sure was. Everything about everything about all that was very unfortunate. That was very lucid. Hey, you know what? Street Fighter Five is a tough game. Fighting games, hey, it's it's rough out here. It's real. Yeah, you know, you think you have one opponent, but you also have to beat next gen console <laughs> night button. Interrupting the match at every this point. This is the next generation like, like the device. Or something. This is you never know when you're gonna you know. No, there's no way there's no way to know. The you assist. couldn't have prepared for that. You thought you were sitting down for ninety nine second rounds, at most three out of five. Instead they sat there for like fifth that was like twenty minutes. That was that a was gnarly rough. match. That was rough. Maybe when you know you're gonna lose you just hit the guide button just to add some churn to the match. I don't know. Maybe this is what how these kids play. They're like, I can't unplug my router, so I'm just gonna. I don't understand the youth. <laughs> this is how I know I'm getting. I'm old. I'm old and out of yeah, touch. Yeah, we're, we're out of this. There's, there's no place for us. This is yeah. This is crazy. Continuing on though, in the loser side of the bracket, we do have Paul Lee stepping up to the sticks again, bringing that Zangi faction. Uh yes. Last time didn't quite work out against Abigail, but the trend has been set. Ryu has won, so perhaps. Hey, Ryu is on a winning streak right now. This <laughs> yeah. is the longest streak of the event, maybe even the season. Yeah, this is the, the Ryu, longest streak ever. So I mean, look at Ryu. Ride is, the wave. Ryu, yeah, Ryu has been in a slump. But the thing is, this is, a, this is year 30 of his career. I mean, you know, he's got a long, he might have, there might be six more, five more Street Fighters left. You know, Street Fighter 10, he's back in it. Don't count this guy out. It. You just stick to it. Zanki versus Ryu, classic. Oh, but this looks like trouble. There you go. Zanki can try his best to get in, but Ryu really giving him a lot of opportunities here. Easy stun, Zanki. Ooh. Yo, that damage. And Pauly looking good right here. J Dam, gonna have to dig deep. Oh, what? Oh my gosh. That's the greatest whiff punish of all time. Ooh. Crush counter. Crush counter. Sweep. No follow up. Oh, oh okay. Call, the calls meta. him out on the flex. You see, the meta has changed. Wait, what? What's the read? Oh my god, the lariat through? Pro I mean, that's how you beat giant fireballs. You all just right. spin. Like uh oh. It. Pro wrestling, the strongest discipline. Ryu is trained for 30 years to learn sure. how to throw that super fireball. Woo. And Zangief just spins right, lariats right through it. You can't touch this guy. That was a fast two rounds. Yeah. By comparison to the last grind of a set we saw, that was a fast two rounds. That was rough, yeah. This is the first win for player two. I hate that voice. After that last yeah. set, Paul, though, totally focused. Ready to go. Oh, Lariat. Oh, Ryu coming enough. in. Se season one, maybe, not season two. Gonna have to tighten that up. Sure use for days. But no fear. And the right read finds the hit. What? Wake up. You. Oh my gosh. The look, the meta is different now. Look, we, we, we've seen it in action. Oh my god. Oh gosh. my god, what a V trigger activation. Catches him on the fourth fierce. EX SPD. One more hit. One more hit. Sit down. Oh, oh no, the you call don't. Out. You know? This is what I'm saying. That was so next level, actually. They're going to study this in future Street Fighter classes. They'll study that moment. Ooh. What a response. That was actually so good. Except for the part where, you know, they cancel on accident. Oh, here it comes again. Lariat through. Oh, just jump over. Oh, oh my he, gosh, that's he gotta hurt. Strong wake up pressure. Going for the block. Again. Running back. Are you gonna uppercut again? Over under. Oh, <laughs> what about this time? Oh, there it is again. Headbutt. Third oh. time. Not always like the name. charm. 
Oh my Name gosh, just the style on him. Oh my gosh, that is that is mental damage right there. That is that can cause some emotional scarring. This may carry over. To, yeah, give it up. Yep, so, yep, yeah. yeah give yeah, it up. Give it up. Give it up. That was a very impressive performance by uh, my name is Paul Lee. Just planting him. That's the type of stuff where, you know, you, th you, you think about it. You think about your losses. You think about your wins. But that's the type of stuff that may or may not put you into the therapist office. Because like you're going to have to hold that L maybe forever. I mean, it's Wolf Crone, right? And I feel like you're on the other side of the bracket. So, yeah, I mean, uh, you know, lots of times in fighting games, it comes down to your willingness or unwillingness to accept defeat and what you're going to do to recover from these losses. I mean, where did he go? Where did the Ryu guy go? Actually, I want to talk to that guy. I want to see if he's going to be coming back. Ah, where did he go? No, 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 the Ryu guy. Where did the Ryu guy go? He was just here. He was just here. Oh, there you are. Yeah, there you are. Yeah, okay. Are you going to Are you going to um you going to think about this and and think about that loss and and come back stronger or are you giving up on Street Fighter forever? Oh, no way, man. No way. Not giving up for for, for a minute. Going to just keep going. Going to keep trying. Would you run it back with him at PAX 2018? Oh, yeah. I'll give it a try. I'm open for it. I'm all back down for a challenge. All right. You got 364 days from this moment to train for that run back. And hopefully, maybe it'll be here. Maybe Geico Gaming, the Gecko, and E-League will team up again for another amateur series. And the buildup to the match starts now. You know what I mean? Like, next, uh, like this was WrestleMania for you. Now we got SummerSlam, Survivor Series, and the Royal Rumble. So you got an entire year to prepare for next year. Are you ready? Are you up for the challenge? Oh, yes. I'll put in my prayers, too. <laughs> All right, take the prayer, say the vitamins. <laughs> we got Wolf Crow coming up next, playing a character, playing a character I believe that has been taking a lot more than just vitamins. From my, is he sticking to the Abigail even against our boy John Tanella? These are not vitamins. These are not vitamins. Oh wait! Oh! And I love how much that says, right? We've seen uh, Abigail the whole bracket, but just the presence of our. Pre-disconnecting well. pad controllers leveled up, John Tanella. <laughs> Sensu beat John Tanella coming in. And he's going to pick Laura. No more Abigail. No more Vroom Vroom. No, no. We're going to bring that uh, dip it in. Yeah. Wolf Crone is not messing around. If you guys were watching E League on TBS this past spring, you may have seen Wolf Crone do so much damage. So and much. there was a trail of dead bodies. This guy was playing on national TV. Yeah, he straight he straight destroyed on that series. Yes. Couldn't quite close it out, but destroyed. Yes, and he was playing Laura. So for those keeping score, this is the first time that Wolf Crone is not playing Abigail. Instead, he's playing Laura. And he is a force to be reckoned with. Yeah, make no doubt. If you ever make the mistake of thinking he should switch to Abigail in the set, that's just that's a testament to John more than it is about the character. Laura is the main. Wolf Crow's gonna do work. But Nikali, he triggered. Such a strong character. Looks like a troll doll, but don't let that fool you. <laughs> yeah. Looks buff. are very deceiving. It looks are deceiving. This guy is dangerous. It's pretty serious. Once he gets oh I mean at least in this color, he looks like a Super Saiyan God. Less like a troll doll, more like a Super Saiyan God. But you know. My troll doll kinda looked like that. <laughs> Maybe you guys had different colors, I don't know. But tough situation to be in right now. Laura stuck in the corner. Wolf has got a plan to get out. Side switch. Oh, wake up buttons. Ooh. Oh, my God. All right, on the verge of stun. What's going to happen? Backdash. The reversal? No. Oh, neutral jump. Nick danella has got a big life lead. On the verge of stun again. Oh, bam, blasts through. Oh, he gets clipped anyways. Wolf Crow trying to make it happen here. Oh, that is a heartbreaker. Oh my gosh. Way to stay composed in it though, Nick. Unable to find it. That lower pressure too strong. This is the first win for player one. Looks like we might take a character select screen break. I don't really, I don't know. Do we have other characters for, for uh, Nick Tanella here? 
Or is he just taking that breather? I don't know. See, this is the this, this is the thing. The gimme breather. When you, even if you have a second character that you could pull out, there's oh oh my god. Oh my gosh. Okay, well this is this is winners finals. So one of these right? This is winners finals. So the winner of this qualifies for tomorrow. The loser of this is going to lose his bracket, and the winner of that will qualify also for tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. For to play for twenty thousand dollars, courtesy of the gecko who had to take a nap. Because he danced uh, a Round bit too one. much. He partied pretty hard earlier. Uh, you yeah, guys might have missed it. We'll see. We saw Dean try to pull out that edge, but it didn't quite work out. No, nah, it didn't. So. He was he was inspired and saw that edge and wanted to make it work. Trying to make it happen. But we'll Ooh. see how it pans out here against Laura. Back and forth with the mid screen. Laura, though, huge life lead. That defense too strong. Wow, swinging right now. Not quite working out yet, but we'll see what's in store as Ed builds up the meter. Uh -oh. Gets clipped. Laura, though, moving in. Oki uh -oh. setup. Uh -oh. oh, my God. Just dominance. One more hit. Find the bust out on the EX. Ed's going to have to make a lot happen with a little bit. Whoa. Oh, no. Drops his combo right there. Baits out the V reversal. Didn't expect Reset that to, to hit. neutral. All it's going to take is, is one hit. I'm not quite sure. Okay. Nice close out from Laura there. Quick dash in right there. Ed on the back foot. Match point for Wolf Crone. Sticking with his right. main here. And I don't know, how do you feel about this? I feel like it's more of a switch to try to introduce some churn into the matchup, right? You'd expect the Kali for sure. Well, see, that's the thing. Like. Even if you have a second character that you consider your, that you consider yourself very strong with, when the match is that that first game was not it was not one sided it was actually super close. It was pretty back and so, forth. So, you know, it's it's debatable as to whether or not it was best to switch to a character. Kind of thinking that maybe Wolf Chrome doesn't have a whole lot of uh, character knowledge or experience against Ed. But hey, it's you know. I mean, the first round might not have worked out, but right now Ed yeah. on the life lead. Nick Tanella. Working Looks a like bit of a bit of an advantage here. Yes, Lines and the reversal. His, his V reverse, uh, his V reversal gets him out of the and corner clean. I feel like that jump in could have been the end. Couldn't oh. quite finish it out though. Oh no. Oh no! Please. Ed needing to stay alive. Match point for Wolf Crone. V trigger activated. Not a lot coming off of it. Ed backs away. I don't know if he should have. Trying to stay oh. alive and he finds him with the up kicks. Wow! I was like, I don't know if he should let him out of the corner like that. But he smelled the jump and he aired effectively. He spotted it out. Nick Tanella still in it. Ooh, but it's still match point. Wolf Crone on the Laura. Winners qualifiers match. Winners moving on to Monday, tomorrow for that twenty thousand dollars. That's right. If you guys are here today, if you think it's good today, it's gonna be even better tomorrow. So much pressure in the corner. Look at this. Uh oh. I feel like you take that damage though. You want that side switch just to get out of the corner, get a little bit of room. Let's see what he can do with it. Ed moving in. Trying to keep Laura in the corner. Oh no, that's it. Oh, that's gonna be it. Wolf Crone. Oh Krone. man, Wolf Crone takes it. Too strong. Two too solid. zero over Nick Tanella. Very nicely done. Wolf Crone qualifies into tomorrow's finals. Nick Tanella gonna have to make it through losers side of the bracket, of course. Yes. Only has to wait for the outcome of losers bracket in order to make it happen. Yep. Shao Kahn on the loser side. Yep. Shao Kahn just waiting for the next challenge. I believe Wolf Crone was disconnecting his